celebrating more than a century of bringing French culture to Philadelphia. I'm Jill Horner. This is Comcast Newsmakers. With me is Martine Chauvet. She is Executive Director of Alliance Francaise de Philadelphie. Thanks so much for being with us. Good You're to welcome. see you. Bonjour. <laughs> you are celebrating the 110th anniversary of your organization, and you really have so many programs today, but let's talk a little bit about the core of what you do. You bring French language to people and help people learn a beautiful language at two different locations. Absolutely. We have a location in Santa City, Philadelphia, and one at Bryn Mawr College. And we have over, over 1,200 students from complete beginners to advanced, really advanced conversation classes and specialized classes. We have a class on business French, on you know, different topics. And um, we have immersion classes one Saturday a month. So a wide variety of classes are available, but that's just part of what you do as an organization. Right. You have things like jazz soirees and monthly lunches. We have something going on every month. Uh, coming up, uh, you know, we have our favorite lunches every, every month, one inside the city, one outside of the city. We have conferences. We have soon um, a, um, a, a, an evening at the Philadelphia Museum of Art with another organization, a Turkish organization. We work with different organizations, and uh, it's fun to do that. And you're celebrating the 110th anniversary right. of the organization. It's grown over more than a century. Talk to us a little bit about the organization itself and how you're celebrating. Well, uh, as you said, we were born in 1903, and it's been a real, you know, growing up uh, experience. Uh, in many different ways, and the, tr the way we're trying to do that is to bring more and more um, cultural events as well as, as a school. So um, all our cultural events really are geared towards people who want to learn French or even for Americans who are interested in France and its language and its culture. And you have an upcoming event, and this is your Bastille Day event. It's happening right. July 14th at the Independent Seaport Museum. Talk to us about this event and what it includes. It's a wonderful event, and the, the space is absolutely marvelous because if the weather is nice, we can be outside on the, uh, you know, the, on the terraces. And um, it's a very nice dinner uh, catered by Brilly Catering, which Jean-Marie Lacroix is the, the head of it, so it's always good. And we have dancing, we have a, a silent auction, and we may have a live auction this year also, or starting that, and a raffle of two tickets to Paris um, for those who buy our tickets. And you're encouraging people to attend, even if they've never attended one of your events before, to learn more about your organization. Absolutely, because we'll be around to, to talk about uh, the Alliance, and it's a fun way to, to enter into a new organization, you know, to start a, a new involvement with some, something else. And that again is happening on July 14th at the Independent Seaport Museum, but we mentioned it's your 110th anniversary mm -hmm. as an organization, and really October caps that anniversary, right. and you are partnering with the International Opera Theater. Right, this is a small uh, opera company, but they have decided this year to create a new opera, to write a new opera on Camille Claudel. Camille Claudel worked with Rodin, of course, and um, uh, was uh, interned uh, uh, after a while and for I think about 10 years. So this is also the anniversary of her, um, you know, being a put away. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that is happening in October and that's really the, the cornerstone, like the capstone, if you will, of that's the 110th right. right. anniversary of you as an organization. Absolutely, absolutely. And we hope, we don't know yet exactly where it's going to be, but we'll have a big celebration afterwards. All right, and people can visit your website for more information. Absolutely. We've been talking with Martine Chauvet. I'm Jill Horner.